excuse me, she just exciting like my comics. I'm a Viking, Black Goliath, Bush, Master. Yo. Welcome back, fellow knowledge seekers. It's my comics busting through your speakers. I am your host, Frankie J, and this is where we discuss comics night and day. And yes, we are back with another underrated, underwritten, underestimated character. But first, before we begin, go ahead and smash that like, subscribe bell, and button for upcoming content for my comics. And next, Let's have our weekly salute for those up and coming comic creators. Oh, their work is fire. Show some love. The link to their comics will be in the description box below. Don't be afraid to show some love. And yes, they do commissions. And now, back to our regularly scheduled program. Let's discuss this underrated, underwritten, and underestimated black superhero known as Thunderbolt whose real name is William Carver and hails from the mighty Marvel comics created by Roy Thomas, Gene Colan, and Sid Shores. He first appeared in Daredevil number 69, which was a team up between Daredevil and Black Panther. And he later appeared in Power Man, where he fought against Luke Cage and then fought alongside of Luke Cage as a brother in arms. Yes, we have another black speakster besides the wizard that existed in Marvel Comics. Go figure. Let's do a quick backstory. He's a veteran like myself who returned from military service. In his hometown of Harlem, New York, he was approached by several members of a local street game called the Thunderbolts. Not this Thunderbolts, but a game called the Thunderbolts. Anyways, the Thunderbolt gang wanted Williams to train them on military style tactics. However, like any good military member, he refused. And then later on, Froggy Nelson, a friend of Daredevil, learned of Carver's encounter with the Thunderbolts gang. He instructed Carter to infiltrate the gang to gather enough information to shut them down. Carver agreed to help gather enough information. They succeeded with their plan and it resulted in several members of the Thunderbolt gang going to jail. Now, now, you know now, these now, streets now, be now, talking. talking. The Thunderbolt gang found out what William Carver had did and they took revenge by killing William's younger brother, Lonnie. Now, while he was attending his younger brother's funeral, William spotted his brother's murderer and chased him through the cemetery. He caught up to the murderer and they began to struggle. During the struggle, the two men were struck by lightning. Sounds familiar, right? His brother's murderer died instantly, but Carver was saved by an experimental cobalt radiation treatment. During the treatment, Carver was exposed to an unusual amount of radiation. The radiation mutated his body, giving him the ability to move at superhuman speeds along with enhanced reflexes. At this time, Carver began to call himself Thunderbolt and began searching for his brother's real killers. Let's talk, Let's talk about, about, about how our our really He possessed the superhuman ability to run at great speeds. Although he was not as fast as the mutant Quicksilver, he could obtain speeds up to 85 miles per hour. His reaction time was four times faster than a normal human. His body had mutated in various ways to adapt to running at superhuman speeds such as stronger bones, muscles, and tendons. So this was needed for super acceleration and braking power. He could also process information at superhuman speeds. And since he was a former Marine, he was an expert in hand-to-hand -hand combat. He used this training in conjunction with super speed to defeat super villains. Thunderbolt's visor was equipped with a powerful light called the Thunderbolt Lightning Flare, which he used to temporarily blind his opponents. Thunderbolt's only, only weakness was that the cobalt ray treatment had not only given him the superpowers of super speed, but it also speeded up his aging process, which caused Thunderbolt to age several age years per week, per week, which means he passed away at an early age. He fought crime until the day he died. This is who they need to bring back with increased powers and speed. Thank you for watching this video, and this will conclude the video. Yo, Charles Hazleton the third. Bring that outro! Without fear, picking up the real comic stacks. This new stages dope spills will have you stepping back. Alternative factuals got me to approach the nerd. Now I got the comic power of the Panther God's word. Without fear, picking up the real comic stacks.
stacks. This new stage is dope skills, but have you stepping back? Alternative factuals got me to approach the nerd. Now I got the common power of the Panther God's word. Dressed in all, just exciting like my comics. I'm a Viking, Black Goliath, bro.